hello friends welcome back hearty welcome to you in this session we'll see how to find out the equation of parabola when the vertex is at h comma k but not at the origin so let us take a parabola we know that a parabola which is opening to the right side at origin is given by y square equal to 4 a x now suppose the vertex of the parabola is at h comma k but not at origin 0 comma 0 then it is given by y minus k whole square equal to 4 into a into x minus h where h comma k are the coordinates of the vertex let us say h comma k are the coordinates of the vertex then the coordinates of the focus will be h plus a comma k and the coordinate of the point where the axis of parabola meets the directrix is h minus a comma k this point is h minus a this is h minus a minus k this is h comma k vertex and this is the focus so we have axis of parabola is a line parallel to x axis and directrix is a a line parallel to y axis now how to solve this for that what we will do we will take we will take a arbitrary point x comma y somewhere let us say this is the point x comma y and according to the definition of parabola this distance should be equal to the distance to the directrix so this distance is equal to that distance suppose i say this is p and this is m we have s here we know that s p equal to p m we can write down that s p equal to p m or can i say s p equal to p m squaring on both sides we have s p square equal to p m square now sp square is nothing but x minus of h plus a whole square x minus h plus a whole square plus y minus k whole square that is sp square what is pm square pm square is the perpendicular distance of x y from this particular directrix what is the equation of directrix let's write down the equation of directrix equation of directrix is uh, you know that in a vertical line x coordinate is constant so this is x equal to h minus a or can i say x minus h plus a equal to zero now the perpendicular distance from this particular point to x y point to the directrix is nothing but x minus of h minus a or x minus h plus a whole square how we know that because on a horizontal line we know the y coordinate is same that is nothing but y and the x coordinate is the same on the vertical line that means it's nothing but h minus a so its coordinates are h minus a comma y the coordinates of m r h minus a comma y so when we simplify this let's open here x minus let's open the brackets here what we will have we'll have y minus k whole square is equal to we'll simplify this we'll have x square a minus b whole square formula plus h minus a whole square minus 2x into h minus a and we will get we will get x minus h plus a whole square here so it will be minus x square minus of h plus a whole square after that we will have plus 2 into h plus a into x we'll simplify this the next step will be we can cancel x square x square we have y minus k whole square equal to we have 
h minus a whole square we have h minus a whole square minus of h plus a whole square which is of the form a minus b whole square minus of a plus b whole square which is nothing but equal to minus 4ab so I can write down minus 4ah then we will open brackets here we have minus 2xh plus 2ax plus 2xh plus 2ax we can cancel 2xh and 2xh we are left out with y minus k whole square equal to 2ax plus 2ax is 4ax 4ax minus 4ah the next step we can write down y minus k whole square y minus k whole square is equal to 4 into a into x minus h so this is the this is the equation of the parabola whose vertex is at h comma k similarly we can prove that what are the what are the four equations of parabolas we have when vertex is at h comma k vertex is at h comma k these are y minus k whole square equal to 4a into x minus h y minus k whole square equal to minus of 4a into x minus h this is when opening to the left then we have x minus h whole square equal to 4a into y minus k this is opening up top and this is x minus h whole square is equal to minus 4a into y minus k this is for opening down so this is for opening left right and this is for opening left and this is for opening up and this is for opening down so we have four equations when the vertex is at h comma k instead of 0 comma 0 so what will happen y will become y minus k and x will become x minus h it's simply a translation of the origin from 0 0 to h comma k so x will be x minus h and y will be y minus k now let us try to solve some simple examples in the next session based on this particular derivation